Hello, this booth of Star 4A, 165 centimetres long, just come back from the polishers. It's, we decided to get it fully repolished with French polish and then finished off with antique wax. Um, so just want to try and admire the polishing. It's so grateful for French polishers. Who, it's a very pati patient job to do it and uh, certainly worth it, I think, because this is a walnut one. You can see there's always um, a mirroring in walnut. If you see, there's a kind of like... Um, the line there which shows you veneer that side and this side and mirroring to get a, a beautiful pattern and on the top of the fall too. I did show this before it was repolished and we showed uh, some of the defects that we just couldn't disguise enough and did feel that the piano was worth it because the beautiful Star 4A is such a beautiful instrument tone wise and uh, with it was in the queue to polish so we decided to do it. Now look at the top lid and this was a problem before so if you look at the video before I'll try and put a link to the video before so there we are there's no sign whatsoever uh, sorry the lights uh, sky lights above are shining a bit too brightly on it um, but uh, it's not too reflective a finish that's the, what we're trying to achieve is so you can see most of the grain the grain as well as possible um, so you're there with always to be a patch in the middle of the lid so you look back on the previous video so um, we have done a video of about all the work on the piano as well so um, I'll just briefly refer to some of that and because it's all finished now it's all, all completely ready to go um, so if you're interested in the piano we can thoroughly recommend Blue and the Fire Star 4A is one of our favorite baby grands so I did show this before just been looking at it again to see if there's anything just evening out some of the key dip we've redone the key dip because it was a bit shallow and we preferred it a bit, a bit, a bit deeper as it gives a better touch control so there you can see the key weighting we, we have lubricated we said lubricated balance rail and uh, it has brought it down slightly but I think we just want to want to even that out a bit more before we deliver the piano I have done a video of the piano before the work was done and um, it's ha improved it slightly obviously quite a lot actually the touch particularly but you won't hear the touch but it's it's better control over the piano and it, more even tone just evening out the individual hammers to match them in for the size of the piano it has a very rich tone in the bass and a very mellow tone generally so I just play it a bit more so you can be reminded of the tone of the piano thank you very much for listening